Hey guys, Xiaomi. Today we are playing with the banner of the special league, Mr. Chow, right there, the Water Dragon Knight. They buff him and nerf him in the same balance patch. So we'll be using Chow right here on Violent Nemesis, Speed Good Damage and HP. I try to build him really well and uh, I just can't build this unit. I really don't know how, honestly. So Chow can now cleanse two debuff instead of one, which is great because when you put Sun on him, and then put another debuff like glancing attack break slow debuff then he might not cleanse the stun now he has more chance to cleanse the stun on the other hand they actually got nerfed in the last balance patch because they, they took away the cool healing they, they, they reduced it for, for I, I don't know why. why why do you take the healing chow wasn't a very good unit to begin with okay i'm ranting already at the start of the video which is not supposed to be a good thing i'm gonna drop some heat on the enemy right there and ooh, we might be winning this without Chow because my Eureka draft was very spectacular. Because he has two win units to control, so controlling Eureka might not be very easy. I'm gonna put this on you. And then we're gonna try to put this on you. Defense break. Okay. Oh, 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 okay, okay, good damage. <laughs> That was, uh, that was definitely, definitely not good right there. So Chow is, I, I think Chow is okay. They actually buff another unit that make Chow even worse to use, which is Camilla. So Camilla is kind of the same thing. Can I say that? I can definitely say that, right? So Camilla also self-heal, self-cleanse, but Camilla can also heal an ally, which is really, really good. And Camilla provide a freeze and a slow debuff that is extremely good can i crit of course i can't because i have elemental disadvantage we're gonna kill the robo right here i think that that moron should die to the dots this guy if he use skill he will die to the dot as well he, he just die in general so camilla provide a lot of team utility and pvp value with control damage healing and self-sustain Camilla is pretty much a very, very... Oh, Camilla, can, can she strip? No, she can't. Oh, Camilla can randomly just increase cooldown with skill one. Might or might not happen. It's like a Wusa, right? When when it happens, you, you're over the moon because it's just it's just a great thing. So, Chao, who was already not as good, didn't get a whole lot of new thing. And Oh, oh God. If I lose to a Thessarian... I almost lost to the Thessarian. <laughs> I almost lost to Cesarian. Oh my god, we actually win. So Chow, who, who was not very good to begin with, didn't get any better. He, he got a little bit better, I would say. A little bit. Okay, because if you get like 3 debuff on him, <laughs> and he doesn't cleanse the right one, then you're still going to be in sh And they also nerf him a little bit. Meanwhile, Camilla, this thing right here, which I also have runes on, it's just a wonderful, amazing thing. I'm so sad that I don't have skill up on Camilla, because in the past, she doesn't need skill up to do what she is really good at right which is to tank win unit i didn't need skill up for that so i didn't put any any skill up into her and and i really regret that because i have max skill chow okay <laughs> i don't know why i did this he didn't need to have any of this oh my god that is one of my life biggest regret okay you know what we can actually pick camilla here to 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 show how how good camilla is as well so camilla become a much more value team player while chow remain at the same spot i think they should just allow chow to cleanse everything right because camilla she cleanse everything remove chow should be able to cleanse everything come on he's gonna ban my wind monkey king nah i'm gonna ban the wusa because uh, I, I need to put debuff on them and I don't really have a very good stripper. So we're gonna be dealing with that that wind panda. And if my Camilla frees the wind panda, it's gonna be the best thing ever because Chow, Chow will get eaten by the wind panda for breakfast any day of the week. Oh God, that, that was a lot of stuff going on with that Ethna right there. And that's gonna be a big stun on the monkey. So I can, I need to focus on the, oh, she's doing, She's doing a great job. She's putting the debuff on the right unit. Um, I didn't put Karma on there. That's unfortunate. Can I defense break? That is good. Can I crit? <laughs> what if I'm gonna freeze? Okay. Look. Look at that. That slow fire bison will will not take a turn for a long, long time because because of that freeze from 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 my Camilla. That was just absolutely wonderful. Meanwhile, Chow. There, there was there was nothing that Chow could really do, <laughs> really. 
really there was there was really nothing that Chao could really do right there. If I hit the fire unit, I would do like minimal damage. If I hit the wind unit with defense break, big chance to glance. Meanwhile, Camilla could have done the freezing thing. And if if I have max skill, that thing has two turn cooldown. That is so much value. Yeah? That is insane value. So now I have to find a way to kill the panda. And my two water unit hopefully will kill the two fire unit. No problem. But then my monkey has defense break on the Ethna. So, oh my god. That thing is in a lot of trouble right now. Can I do some good damage? That was not too bad, I guess. If I land the increased cool time right there, that'd be so funny. <laughs> that would be... Oh, no. Oh, oh, my defense break is gone. There's no way my two water unit has any chance. I land the increased cool time. No. No way. Chow's dead. Chow is just dead, dead, dead. Right? Can I do damage on the monkey? That was... Can you see the healing on Chow? I kind of... Look at Camilla! Camilla is, is actually helping Chow. Oh, if I land that freeze, that'll be insane. Camilla actually provides some healing for the Chow. That is wonderful. Look at the team. Team... Dude, this thing... This thing is unfair. How did, how did it crit off element two times in a row? <laughs> it just stunned me. <laughs> what the fuck? And it even crit me, so it, it can cleanse me. Unbelievable. Yeah, there's there just no way. Wind Panda was made to, to eat Camilla since the golden day of Summoner's War. So as you can see, please come to us. Buff Chow, like give him a meaningful buff, dude. I say that in the next balance patch, gonna be Chow, skill two, damage plus 10%. It's gonna happen, okay? <laughs> uh, it's just gonna be a complaining session about Chow, probably. Oh, look, I can self-cleanse all the debuff that Shizuka's gonna put on me. That is incredible. I think if they put debuff on Chow, he should get like free attack bar. You know, like Juno, Juno get speed buff when, when somebody trying to debuff her and she cleanses the debuff when it's her turn. Chow is kind of similar. Chow will cleanse the debuff when it's his turn. I think he should gain some attack power when they debuff him. Like, uh, he's like a mini self-sustained ragdoll kind of thing. Isn't that kind of cool? Wow, I said that. I realized that Juno is kind of similar to Chow. But Juno cleanse every debuff and heal the entire team with a fat heal. And Juno can do very, very good damage. Oh, yeah. Juno is just like a cooler Chow. <laughs> oh my god. Everything in this video is just like me trying to get Chow to get buff. Okay? Don't don't go in the comments and be like, you hate Chow, Sean. You are a hater. I I really want Chow to get buffed. He he every dragon knight is cool, right? And and I think Chow deserves to to have a better life than than what he's currently having right now. He, he need to he need to have a better life. Okay guys? Okay, how do we win this? He kind of dropped everything on me, but he didn't really achieve anything. Who should get destroyed right now? To achieve that, I need to land defense break. So, I'm going to go for him. And then, oh, I don't have defense break. Can I stun? That's a good stun right there. That also gives stun to the to the Shizuka, but that doesn't really mean anything, right? Because our entire team is like a bunch of self cleanse maniac. Oh, God. Like, look, she's gonna do the thing. I mean, she can't even do the thing because it, it achieved nothing. It gave my my Juno a chance to strip, and it gave my it, it doesn't even stop the child from moving, which is kind of cool. My team is a bunch of self clans. I should have picked Veramos for more self clans, right? Uh, stun this, please. Very nice stun because he can defense Rex. So I don't like that. Let me try and do some damage on you. Gosh, the damage. <laughs> He can put a dot with skill one. Oh my god. Dragon Knight skill one dot is kind of a meme, right? It's just kind of a meme. Ouch. Gosh, this Karno. This Karno is doing a very good job at doing damage to my entire team. I have so many healing, and somehow my entire team is in trouble because this guy damage is crazy. He did 3k per hit with that skill three? That is wow. Oh no, that speed buff is supposed to be. Uh oh. How do I kill this guy? I have to kill this guy, but I can't. Wow, that that, that Carno is just incredible. Very, very good damage. It's probably on crit damage. And it's really, really tanky. Oh, giving my uh giving my Juno some free attack bar. I like that. Juno is dead. <laughs> oh god, Juno's gone. Juno's gone. My counter Shizuka's gone. 
Attack bar reduction, guys. Look, look at this. I'm all dying to... Oh, look at this. And now Chow... Get provoked. And we dead. <sighs> I think if, if I pick Leo instead of Chow, I think I could have had a much better team right there. Because, uh... Yeah. Chow just kind of doesn't do anything. <laughs> I think the only way Chow can shine is when you draft Chow into a full fire team and he's the last fight so that he get banned. That's pretty much it. Oh, well, finally a draft where Chow is not bad. So he can stun. So I'm going to pick Chow and I'm going to pick this guy so that I can strip counter the Masha and also hopefully get the stun and proc, proc some shield to deal with the, the mouse over here. All right, we're gonna ban the wind unit, pick a water unit, and it's gonna be absolutely incredible. Okay, Chow make it through. Will we see Chow die to this way better water bruise over there? This guy, this guy on the screen right there. Oh my God. They show the screen of this guy and he's in the draft. He's probably gonna get 10% boosted RNG and there's nothing I can do about it. Let's see what happened. So you can't stun Chow. I wonder who is gonna be his main target it's gonna be the Raccoonie. Ooh, that's a fat stun from the monkey already. That's pretty cool. Who do I go for? Do I go for Vanessa? Or do I go for the... Oh my god, that's a lot of damage from Raccoonie. He chose the right target. Not gonna lie, he chose the right target. I'm gonna make sure that I give this a turn. I'm gonna provoke this guy because his skill 2 hurts. I couldn't get the provoke. Let's go for the damage. That's not a whole lot of damage right there. Defense break, please. Good defense break. Oh, it's going to do a lot of damage on my Raccoonie right there. I think I shall boost Raccoonie own turn to get that. I think I made a wrong move right off the bat. Okay, guys, I saw that. Now I think about it. I should have boosted Raccoonie for a little bit extra healing. The speed buff kind of didn't have to be there. But I think the kill should happen any time now. Oh, almost took away my defense break right there with the Vanessa. But he can get... Where, where is his defense break? Interesting. Okay, Raccoonie keeping the team alive. Shall I want to finish that thing off? Get a violence, come on. Bruh. <laughs> uh, I wish there's some sort of mechanic to make Chow just move a little bit faster. Because whenever he takes a turn, he does kind of similar damage to Mouse. Probably less. Unless there's defense break involved, but it's not that easy to get defense break involved all the time. Why is this thing not using any skill too? Is it because of the Raccoonie cleanse? It's kind of strange that he's spamming skill 1 instead of using any skill 2 like at all. Alright, hopefully it's going to finish the Wusa. Decent damage. And then we're going to go for this guy right here. I think he just drafted in Chow favor. Oh no, my healer is dead. Now this is trouble. Now he can skill too. Yeah, he's, he's waiting. Oh, and then he missed it. Don't take away my, my defense break, please. Please, give me my defense break. Okay, I can finally kill this guy if I get to move. Um, Can you don't touch my monkey? That'd be very wonderful. Okay. Revenge. Oh, hey! I can't, I, I want to hit him with defense break. That's so annoying. Stun? Oh no, I think the revive passive is coming back. Oh no. Oh no, and he's way faster than me. That is very, very troublesome. And this guy just refused to try to stun me, which is a very smart choice. So, oh no, ouch. So then he doesn't trigger any shield. Can I kill this guy? He's the main damage dealer. Oh, that's good. Chow, oh, 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 Chow popping off. Okay. We will survive. We will survive, baby. I'm gonna finish you. Might as well. Stun you. Oh, I should have saved the defense break. But we glance anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Maybe you can pro... Who do I kill here? Try drop Masha off the beast? Oh, oh, that's a good try, girl. That is a good try. The revive passive should have long cooldown now, like 6 turn. So it's gonna take a while for her to actually get back the revive and there's no way this is gonna crit me easily right nice slow debuff not gonna happen i'm gonna take that away even if you defense break me it's gonna take that away stun no stun we don't have the skill just yet can i get a violent beautiful we're gonna finish you and we win 
a legit chow draft. <laughs> Not bad. Oh my god, that is a lot of oblivion. If I ban this guy, the only thing he has is oblivion, right? I want to see what it looks like. But wow, he, he came prepared. This man came prepared. Bonjour. Let's see if your double oblivion can deal with all my passive. Actually, his entire team has oblivion and defense break. I just realized that. His entire team has oblivion. So he has no cooldown on oblivion. Oh. Shit. If I use the skill, I just really... God, I hate it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. What is happening? <laughs> Guys? What is happening right now? Stop. Stop. Stop doing that. Whoa. Oh my. Oh wait. Chow didn't eat the Oblivion. But I got Karma. Oh my god. What is really happening? I'm going to try to damage this thing. Didn't do a whole lot right there, as you can see. Oh no. I can't do anything, guys. There are way too much Oblivion. Oh, defense break. Ah, god damn it. If I land a defense break right there. Oh, he can transfer the stun back to the monkey. Oh, he just stun Chow. Didn't happen. But he did get the heal. Oh, but Juno's dead. Raccoonie is almost dead. <laughs> this is bad. Oh, no. I have to kill her. I think that is the, the source of the problem. Right? Stun. Good, good, good. Because she healed and she put three turn of bleeding. That is just way too freaking good right now. Wow, wow, wow. I'm in a lot of trouble if I don't strike down this thing. Come on, I just need I just need one more turn. Please. Raccoonie, I think I have to Raccoonie's dead. <laughs> Can I defense, right? Oh, but I can't kill her. She has the revive thingy. Can I violent? Violent? I can kill it if I violent proc. No, I can't. And now, oh, she she literally go up my ass. This <laughs> that was literally a stick up my ass, and I can't do anything about it. Unfair, guys. Unfair. Well done. This is a great team. If you have problem, why did I speak like an Indian for a second? If you have problem with passive nonsense, try that man's team. Just have two army Yanji. You know, nothing crazy right there. But that was that was pretty good. I also ruined Laika with some speed, so we might pick Laika in here. Because Laika revenge can be pretty funny. You know what? Let's pick Laika in here. Why not? We're gonna ban. We always ban this guy, right? The attack buff is way too good. Okay, we have revenges and two Dragon Knight. We have a lot of revenges on our team. We have three units that can potentially revenge. Three. That's pretty good. If I revenge, that is. We got one revenge. Good. Good start. Good start. <laughs> one revenge. Okay, what's happening next? Gosh, that was one. Oh, Laika. Laika still haven't revenged yet. <laughs> this unit is so bad. Oh, God. Laika, do something. Laika's dead. Laika's <laughs> dead. Dude, Laika sucks. Laika's even worse. No wonder no, nobody use you. Okay, the... the de oh, the setup is just terrible. I couldn't defense break and trying to kill this guy immediately we are in a lot of trouble right now can i stun can i kill okay that's good oh wait are we winning not yet because this is the important part okay chuck and cleanse all that right that's the that's the deal bruh come on that was the one chance i had to win was the one chance I had. Now I can't win this anymore. Oh, can I? I mean, they don't really have damage. But talk about healing. I don't really have healing either. Can I Valent? I, I can't. I, I can kill this guy, actually. I have speed proportional HP loss, so I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be, like, controlled too much. Right? Great. <laughs> They took three turns, I took one. Look at the healing I have. It's so pathetic. And the damage is also pathetic. Give me the all healing back game. Unbelievable. Oh, God. 
Maybe when he below 50% HP, he should ignore element. Okay? Maybe. He stunned my bird when I had that one chance to. I'm so sad. Chow, you can be so much more, man. You can be so much more. All right, guys, that was a quick Chow showcase day. More like a Chow please buff essay. But thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.